this is Nate from Daily Motor and today we've got this beautiful 2007 GMC Yukon Denali XL. This is equipped with the 6.2 liter 380 horsepower naturally aspirated V8. Come around it's very long. It's getting back in. Greeted with beautiful leather interior. Start it up, hear that V8 rumble. Since this is a used vehicle, there are some warning lights on the dash, and this vehicle in particular is 201,000 miles on it. This vehicle is obviously not going to represent the fuel economy numbers that it came with from the factory because it is very old. And it's got a lot of wear and tear on it but that's the interesting part right the other thing with this is the air conditioning does not work with this vehicle so I've just got it set to 60 degrees windows are open right now I will shut those before I start the test as you probably know by now we do this test because the EPA averages 48 miles per hour for their highway ratings, which is obviously not accurate because cars go much faster than that. They can do 50. So the goal of our tests here at Daily Motor are to replicate the more real world fuel economy numbers that are at 70 miles an hour. So let's pull up to and pump and spend all of my money on gas one trip pulling up here yeah this thing's a fucking bus well the EPA numbers for the 07 Yukon with the 62 are 12 city and 18 highway here at Daily Motor we do the three click method so oh my god like I said this has 201,000 miles so Mind the rust and the flex tape. There's a little bit more there. Some scratches. Some more rust. This, you just gotta hold on to that. And I'll wait, I don't have a watch, about 20 minutes for this to fill up. Oh my God, this takes forever. I've already been here for like a minute. It's still filling up and it was at a had a quarter of a tank left, we're already passing $50. This thing is not too kind to your wallet, that's for sure. Oh my god. Alright, three click method. And if you are wondering why I'm doing this test at night, it is because we do not have any air conditioning. So, put up the windows and I am ready to bake. Fuel is at full. Good, we want that. So, we will go to our little cellular device, reset all the values, go here, get rid of all the warning lights, reset the trip, and let's get on the road. Of course, we want to be not feathering the throttle, but we don't want to be lambasting it either because obviously we want this to be a real world fuel economy test. Get to do a little handling test. No, I'm just kidding, it's not that boaty. It's a boat, but it's not Titanic. I would say it's it's like a very nice luxurious yacht. Getting up speed. I'm going to use the GPS o meter down there to figure out when I'm at 72 miles an hour. Hit this little button here, then you hit that. So, yeah, we are now cruising at 72 miles an hour. Perfect. As for 
the luxurious driving experience of the Denali. It is absolutely sublime. Comfortable, spacious interior with this nice beige leather and fake wood grain. Just make this a nice, relaxing, chilling place to spend the miles. And this thing just absolutely irons out all of the bumps that could possibly be on a Michigan highway. So we're going to do 50 miles out and 50 miles back. And I hope you guys enjoy the montage we have set up for you over there. And I will see you on the trip back. to the last few few miles on the highway and we have used just under a quarter a tank of fuel. A few things I want to point out that TPMS sensor is not accurate. We check the tire pressures and set the pressures according to what the vehicle says they should be before the test. Uh, check engine light, don't know what that is. We've done about 102 miles, averaging 70 miles per hour, as indicated on the phone thing right here. A few notes on the Yukon Denali. It is extremely comfortable, as I said before. Irons out bumps, back doesn't get sore, extremely smooth, extremely quiet, very good road presence doesn't wander or anything very smooth it is overall a very excellent experience on the highway the only thing I suspect that will not be so excellent is the fuel economy it's probably used about five gallons I'm estimating but we'll have to find out when we get to the pump shut the vehicle off all right three clicks 5.99 gallons of fuel. We used 5.99 gallons of gas. 105.5 divided by 5.99. 17.6 miles per gallon. This is a 31 gallon fuel tank. That means if you have 31 times 17.6, about 545 miles on 31 gallons of gas. 2007 GMC Yukon Denali XLs with the 6.2, 17.6 miles per gallon. That is not so good, but it is a five and a half thousand pound vehicle with a 6.2 liter V8. What do you expect? When you, when you have this car, you just got to not care about that at all. And if you don't care about it, if it doesn't matter to you, it is one of the most enjoyable vehicles to drive. I'm Nate from Daily Motor, and as always, drive on. Mm -hmm.